this is uh, Sulfonitis sinua. It's not a big orchid. It's not fragrant. It's very cute. There's another example. Uh, it's uh, native to South America, Argentina. Uh, it's now called Catlia. Um, it's uh, Catlia sinua. You can see the little blue pollen right there. Uh, it's absolutely adorable. Um, and it makes adorable hybrids as well. Um, there are things related to it, but what's really nice about it is that um, uh, it can tolerate Florida, so it's about 95 degrees. Um, this one's blooming right now, it's June 1st, which is very odd, and it looks like it's actually um, taking the seed pods, that's, that's going to abort right there. But the one with the wire on it is looking good. Um, I think that one below it might take two. Um, as far as capsules and breeding goes, but uh, it is uh, it is normally blooms in uh, winter and spring, and it's quite prolific. So this is a little bit unusual. Anyway, I thought I'd say a couple of words on this adorable species. That's uh, I can tolerate uh, this these conditions. That's wonderful, but uh, most Sophronides and Catleas of this sort uh, cannot. I realize the sulfonides have become catholicists. So anyway, there's, there's my thought.